सो हे गाइज रवि हेयर एंड वेलकम बैक इन माई YouTube चैनल जावा स्क्रिप्ट साइंट्रिक सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विद यू हाउ यू कैन रन रिएक्ट नेटिव एंड्रॉइड ऐप ऑन योर मैक एम वन सिस्टम सो एज यू कैन सी दैट आई एम यूजिंग सिक्सटीन जी बी रैम मैक एम वन सिस्टम सो लेट स्टार्ट द टॉपिक before starting this video i will suggest you to go uh, to that um, the last video that i have uploaded on the android studio setup on mac ml system uh, please watch that video first then you can continue this video because in this video i am going to use android emulator preview version still android studio is not supporting the mac ml system uh, therefore we will use android emulator preview version let's open the android emulator so as you can see So it will take some time to open. So we have started uh, the Android emulator. Now we have to open the terminal in the project directory. So I am using this React Native directory. So after starting the Android emulator, you have to edit your Bash profile. So for that one, you have to write this command. profile now it will open another terminal i have already set the path here for android home then the path you can see for this sdk so you can uh, use this setting also on your system then just save it and close that one now you can reload that bash profile by running this command okay now we have to test whether the adb or uh, this emulator is a uh, running or it is a uh, automatically detecting this uh, emulator or not so we have to check uh, adb devices now we can see that uh, this emulator is running and it is detecting so here we have to create a new project uh, new react native project uh, and px uh, react native init android app so it will create a new project inside the react native directory okay so the react native project is created now we will move to that directory and again we will check whether adb devices is working or not so you can see it is still running now we have to open that uh, android project so inside the react native we have this android app now we will open this into the visual studio code here we have to go to the android folder now here in this folder we have to create a file local dot properties now here we have to set the path of sdk here you have to enter the username so this is uh, my system username you can replace this with your system username and then just uh, save it and close this one now again we have to move to the terminal that already we are using here we have to run this android project so let run this project so it will open the metro server so because the android emulator is already running so it will create a project and the app will open and it will run so it will take some time to building the app as you can see the app is running on our android emulator so we can modify the code also and we can check whether it is reflecting the changes or not so for that one we have to go to the app.js file and here 
we can replace this whole thing with a simple one I removed that code and putting simple code here hello world with a simple text and then this view so let's see the emulator now you can see this is reflecting hello world so by this way you can run your react native android project on your android emulator so if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe this channel for upcoming latest videos or if you are facing any issue while running the android app on your android emulator so please comment and definitely i will help you so thank you for watching this video hope you like this video so we will meet in the next video till then bye bye